Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Circle 501, and today I'm going to show you guys a glitch that allows you to have no cooldowns on any abilities on any of the characters in Borderlands 3. Now, my most recent video was actually on two glitches for Zane, and one of the glitches that I thought was only specific to Zane was this actual glitch, and I thought it was actually working in a different way than it was and I thought it was only usable on Zane. It is actually usable on any character and pretty much just tied to your account. So first we're gonna test it and I'll show you guys how it works on Zane. So basically if I use my drone right now that has about a minute cooldown, it's gonna be much less because I have multiple cooldown things just baked into the profile pretty much because of guardian ranks, which is actually where this glitch is. But as you'll see, when this drone ends, it has a decently long cooldown. Now, this glitch is tied to your profile and tied to having a certain guardian rank and a certain um, talent in your guardian rank, which we'll look at in a second. So if you see my drone cooldown now, it has a decently long cooldown. But with the guardian ranks, there's this guardian rank talent right here called Topped Off. This is what's actually causing the glitch to have no cooldowns. So action school cooldown rate increase at full shield. So you do need a shield active to do this. But this will stack every time you respec on any character in the game. Now I thought it was actually on adrenaline. Um this talent right here, just adrenaline on Zane, because it pretty much does almost the same thing as the Guardian Rank talent, which is why I thought it was doing this. And pretty much if you didn't know about this talent or did it do any more testing or anything on other classes you would think it was just adrenaline because it rel it pretty much does the same thing but now as you see i have no points and you have to put one point in i'll put it in a shield recharge rate and then i'll just respec a bunch of times and this is all you do you have to put in one point so you're ap actually able to respec and you could do do this as much as you want to get the cooldown as low as you want but once you get the cooldown to such a low point that it's considered not having a cooldown. Um, it still technically has one because it has to refresh. Um, it has to refresh your ability once it's done being used. So you can't get to absolute no cooldown rate where you can just spam an ability like a machine gun. But you can do it pretty fast. So I do that a couple times. And I'll use my drone now. And as you see, it says my drone is a 3 second cooldown. So when my drone is actually done being out... It'll only have a three second cooldown. And this can be done on anybody, not just Zane. So we're actually going to switch. We're actually going to wait for my drone to actually be done. So you guys can just see that the cooldown is actually three seconds. And then we're going to be able to go on any other character we want and do the same exact thing because your guardian ranks are tied. So as you can see, three second cooldown instead of whatever it was before, probably like 30 seconds or something like that with the just baked in cooldown I have. So now we're going to go to the main menu and just get on a different character. So we're going to go ahead and get on Amara, which probably has some of the better ability stacks used on this. Um, probably, most likely, the best person is going to actually be Flak. So you can just pretty much use Fade away an unlimited amount of time. So you'll basically just be able to crit forever all the time, which will probably be the strongest. But there's definitely some cool builds that I think you can do with this. Also, take into consideration that you can't go to the main menu and do it. So as we use phase cast right here, it does normal cooldown, a decently long cooldown. You can't go to the main menu or anything like that while doing this. So it'll have to be every play session. You can't really farm a specific boss with this. But you could go farm circles of slaughters. You could do, um, you know, you could go around and kill every boss and do it like that if you wanted to. And it would be pretty good on that. But as you can see, my phase cast has a decently long cooldown. So what we're going to do, actually I don't have a point in, we're going to keep putting into clarity, which is just health regen. And we're going to do the same thing we were just doing on Zane, which you just have to put one point in, which allows you to respec. And then you're just going to constantly respec time and time again, which will allow you to pretty much have no cooldown on your abilities and reduce it however much you want to just like we're able to do it on zane so now if we go spec into phase cast again now it has a two second cooldown as you can see after it's done being fully used and now has a two second cooldown and this can be done with absolutely everything we could go ahead and do this on phase slam 
that has a three second cooldown because it's slightly longer. And then we can just phase slam whenever we want. So this can be used on absolutely any class as you see. I don't think I need to show you guys on other classes. You can do it on absolutely anybody. The only thing you need is to have, what is this? 50 guardian ranks that are all put in hunter to have this and then you have to have a shield required and just respec constantly and respec goes by a percentage of your money so pretty much no matter what how much money you have you can do this pretty much as much as you want so that's pretty much the entire video i might have some footage because i kind of want to try this on like a flak or something in like a circle slider and just see how ridiculous it can honestly be um but I'll probably have some footage just messing around with this at the end of the video. But if you want to stop watching now and just go test the glitch out yourself, that's the end of the what you need to know to actually use this glitch in game. So subscribe for to see more Borderlands 3 content. Leave a like if you liked the video. Leave a comment down below what you think about this glitch. If you guys have any, any other ideas to any other glitches with talents or anything that might work, might work for Guardian Ranks, let me know. I'm going to be testing a bunch more stuff out. And thanks for watching.